that's a different thing. Let's hear from Steve in Sheffield on immigration. He said with trepidation, Steve, tell me. Right, man. I am basically, man, I'm, I'm concerned, very concerned. It's a fact that, you know, this country, in a way, is being overrun. Well, I'm, I've already formed an impression, Steve, that you're uh, a racially pure, majestic, probably Olympian specimen of a man. You're probably uh, the epitome of uh, the white uh, supreme race. So just tell me what your concerns are. Well, um, you know, if the British people knew the, the, the factual statistics that go on immigration these days, you know, we, they, they'd know, you know, how to think and what to think. At 83% of British people, George, want, you know, immigration quotas. Uh, are you a BNP man, Steve? You sorry, mate? Are you a BNP man? No, no, no. I'm, you know, I'm not. I'm not political or anything. What is it that What is it that particularly gets I, your goat? What is it that gets your goat about immigrants? Then why are you sitting at ten fifty-five on a Saturday night nursing your wrath against immigrants? Have they done anything to you, Steve? Well, you know, it's it's a lifestyle my way. I, you know, you know, do cause trouble. You know, up around park in the state where I live. You know, there have been a few incidents, you know, but I didn't raise that, George. You did, mate. Yeah, but I'm, I'm asking you what it is about immigration that's got you so worked up when I'm not even speaking about it tonight, but you've been hanging on and you've come on to speak about it. I'm just wondering what it is that motivates you, that's all. Well, mate, it, it, you know, we're, we're looking at the possibility, you know, of, of more and more Eastern Europeans coming to this country. Mate. Well, what's wrong with that, Steve? Tell me what's wrong with that. It's a strain. But uh, a strain in what sense? The East Europeans that are coming to this country are working and generating wealth in this country. In what way is it a strain? Palestine. Sorry? I will use the example of Palestine, my friend. Palestinians, right, forcibly removed from Palestine into Jordan. You look at what, you know, Palestinian people in Jordan outnumber the actual indigenous Jordanian. Well, that's actually not true, but nonetheless, the point that you make is worth arguing. The Palestinian refugees are not allowed to work. They're, they have to live in refugee camps. They're not allowed to work in the Arab countries that they go to, and they're not allowed to get homes in the Arab countries that they've been driven to. They must remain in these refugee camps. That's not the case with East European immigrants. They're working and building the country and building the wealth that's keeping us all going. For God's sake, man, what's wrong with you? Get a life. I'll be back after this. After the news for the second hour of the mother of all talk shows, it's me, George Galloway, 0871722334489.